guys. <clears throat> this is another messy, messy journaler video, but it's also kind of an art therapy video. So we're gonna sort of tag it as both, both and put it in both playlists. Um, so this is my messy journaler um, journal that we've been working in and uh, making pages in without concern about being neat or clean or making a specific image. Sometimes things come out that I, I work in it with no plan. Sometimes things come out of that, sometimes they don't. Um, I have had a habit lately of taking um, my paint palette. Usually my paint palette is covered in a piece of deli paper or parchment paper. So, and my paint is actually on the paper. So when I'm done and I'm finished with what I've been painting, if there's paint left on here that's still wet, I take it and I do this. And I then do this. And I just smush it around and this is what comes. There's actually quite a few pages in here right now um, that look like this. There's another one. And there's another one. Sometimes because I've used um, shiny acrylic paint, paint, sometimes they stick together, sometimes they don't. But again, this is a messy journal or journal, so we don't care if things you know, are messy and marked up and it's not about that. So what I decided we would do from an art therapy standpoint is open up my journal to one of these pages that I'm kind of feeling at the moment and I wasn't really feeling this one. The colors kind of make me nauseous to be honest, but I'm not feeling like I want to do something with that. And then this one, I don't really feel, I was feeling this one. Hi guys, I want to pop in here for a now second and say, uh, as a reminder, I'm not an art, ther uh, an art therapist. I'm not an art therapist. I'm not a counselor. I'm not a physician by any stretch of anyone's imagination. If you're suffering from any mental health issues, uh, please go get help. There's no shame in that. That's what I'm doing. And I just want to bring you these videos as a way to show you all how I'm helping myself or trying to at least work through my own issues with help from my own counselor. So I hope it gives you some ideas of what you can do. And again, if you need help, please get it. I will try to include a link to a website I found in the US that should help you uh, find someone if you need someone to talk to. And if you you have a link for someone else in the um, a country that you live in that you'd like me to include, please let me know. Private message me, leave it in the comments, um, email me, whatever. Um, you know how to contact me. All right, that's it. Back to the video. And then I just took a quick look at my desk off that way um, because I was going to get a piece of note paper and I found this image, which is from a magazine, which I think I want to put like right there. And this is just really quick and easy, like five minute. If you've already got your journal prepped, this is like a five minute thing. Then I want you to take a piece of note paper and without thinking about it too much, I want you to write down on the note paper what you see in words in the colors and marks on the page. So I'm going to do that. I don't want you to worry about punctuation necessarily or spelling. Again, it's not about that. Um, you could tear it off of the note paper. You could rip it off of the note paper. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna take a glue stick. And first we'll glue this one down. You can do as little or as much as you feel like doing on the pages because it's about expressing how you're feeling and letting it go. And it's not about, again, creating the perfect art journal page and piece of artwork. It's not about that. Okay, again. use our scraper tool. Sorry for the dinging in the background. My computer decided to go crazy with the notifications right as we went live. Um, and it's just only about that. That's it. That's how I'm feeling this morning. That's what this page says to me. And I love it. I would love to see what you're doing with just simple expressive pages like this, um, working through how you're feeling, how you are, 
stress, anxiety, depression, whatever it is. Um, I do have a Facebook group, A Life of Art and Self-Expression. I'd love to see um, your posts over there and tag me in the post. I may not see it right away, but I will see it. And I'd love to see what you're doing. If you have questions, comments, or concern, you can either tag me in said question or comment or concern over in Facebook. You can private message me for Facebook friends, or you can leave it, leave it down here below on the video. Um, I do resp respond to every single comment. I am not an art ther therapist by any stretch of anyone's imagination. If you are suffering from mental health help, please go get some. And um, there's no shame in that. This is what I'm doing for me to help myself. And I hope that by sharing my process, it helps you along the way. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And the most important thing, go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.